Finishing a season with a losing record has been a rarity for Bob Huggins during his 31-year career. In its first season in the Big 12, West Virginia finished 6-12 and in league play and 13-19 and overall, just the third losing season in Huggins' career. The last season left a bad taste in all of our mouths. Uh, and we're kind of anxious to get this season going so that we can get that taste out. Um, we won't forget what happened because that definitely gives us motivation coming into this season. We're so young. It's, uh, like I said, we've got five guys back. We have no seniors. So, uh, no, we're kind of trying to figure it out. This year's team should rely on a perimeter game and will try to play at a faster pace. Uh, definitely outside shooting. Um, we have a lot of new faces and, and coach brought in a lot of shooters uh, and playing a little bit more transition. I think last year we, we kind of slowed the ball down a lot, uh, but this year we got a lot of mobile players. Our big men are mobile, so we're going to push the ball and transition a lot more. But this year we have a, a great team uh, as far as shooting the ball. Um, we're going to continue to run our, our motion style and just continue to move the ball, uh, drive gaps when we can, and create shots for the shooters that we have. Sophomore Aaron Harris became just the second freshman in West Virginia history to lead the team in scoring. His development as a leader and expanding his game will be crucial to the team's success. He's trying to become more of a complete player. He's got to get back, I think, maybe to rebound it a little bit, a little bit more because he did a good job of that a year ago. But offensively, he's, he's so much better. He's a better passer. He, he handles the ball better, plays off the bounce, I think, a lot better than what he did before. He spent a lot of time. He's, he works at it. In addition to adjusting to a new conference last season, the Mountaineers also had to cope with a demanding travel schedule. The Big 12 worked with West Virginia and the member schools to ease that burden this season. You know, I, I, I think the uh, change in some start times, I think, helps us tremendously. And, and certainly being able to stay out there and not come back a couple times.